Yeah, exactly, Marco. I, I, I first question is, are you ready for what's going to take place here in the next two to three weeks? And I'm talking about Gonzaga in the March Madness. I don't know many people who went to Gonzaga. So first question is, are you ready and pumped? Do you think they can do it? Oh, yeah, man. Every year, I mean, uh, I'm confident, but this year, uh, this group is, is something special. Mark Few, uh, Spokane legend, and uh, I can't wait to see what these boys do. We missed out on some March Madness last year, so I'm just itching to watch some some uh, high-level basketball in this tournament. It's going to be fun to watch. Yeah, exactly. Listen, I'm a big fan of the game and pitching. Now, we have dynamic arms, and we're kind of addicted to velocity and analytics and stuff, but I believe the game is slowly shifting back to guys who know how to pitch. That's where you come in. You know how to pitch. You've gotten it done. How do you stay away from the noise, or how do you not pay attention to what people talk about today when it comes to velocity and certain things that uh, may or may not get the job done? Yes, yeah, it's, it's a good question. Um, and it's tough because, you know, that's where our game has gone, you know, in the past few years, even since the time that I signed in, in 2013. I mean, the game is drastically different. Um, you know, everybody's pitching up in the zone. Everybody's finding different ways to get guys out. Um, you know, launch angle became a thing, spin rate. Um, there's just so much new information out there in the game. And it's taken me a long time to learn how to stay within myself and, and know myself, know my strengths. Um, be able to attack the zone in, in a unique way and, you know, fill up the strike zone with five different pitches. That's that's probably my greatest strength. What are you looking to accomplish in spring training, aside from the stats, on what you want your pitches to do getting ready for the season to kick off? I mean, first and foremost, um, you got to have conviction with your fastball. You know, that's where, for me at least, everything starts with, with the old number one, um, in, in, out, up, down. Uh, really just having conviction to both sides of the plate, being able to get up and up and in on some righties that glow side. And um, with that, you know, my timing kind of comes, everything uh, kind of develops off that. Uh, but yeah, I mean, if you can spin a good breaking ball down here, you should be able to spin it anywhere. So, um, you know, hopefully getting some good late break on that and uh, just throwing lots of strikes at everything, man. That's just kind of keeping it simple. Awesome. Well, the Seattle Mariners future is bright and you're a big part of it. Thank you for uh, your time. I appreciate it. It's mostly good to talk to you, man.